Dude, what? How does he getting rocked, bro? Dude, it's 10 1. How's it 10 1? Uh, we played Giants next and kind of just fixing our own mistakes at the moment. And then eventually uh, I'll anti strat what I can and see if it helps us at all. It'll give us like a small advantage, but nothing crazy. I mean, obviously, like defense wise, we have some struggles, but um, I think I already identified the problems. So I think next time we play the map, uh, we'll, it'll be stronger, like our defense for Icebox at least. Do you feel anything for Koi because of this brutal format? I mean, I personally knew the format's already brutal, so it kind of sucks for them, but I mean, I feel bad. I do feel bad. It's just, what can you do? Like, it's out of our control. All right, what's your reaction on Song getting MVP for his first match ever? Oh, he got MVP? I actually didn't even know. <laughs> I mean, he had a lot of haters, so, or at least haters in the pro scene. So it's good that he did well. And I know that boosts his confidence a lot, so probably the next matches he'll do even better. First, let's talk about NRG. Obviously, this team comes into it, Seth, with uh, obviously a lot of praise. Uh, struggling but yeah, they Portuguese. had a fantastic debut for, for two brand new players into this roster. And I think what was really impressive about that game as well was just the, the calling from Finesse and the way they managed to come back in the fight. Yeah. Once more to them at the back of the side, just dropping down, but it is Giants containing. All down to Crashies. This is so difficult. And Hoodie with the Sheriff. Yeah, Drop down, flashing his hands. Comes through deep into the site, but it's just that one for one. Holding the close angles. Giants, really great control of this one. And a shot. You take him down, you're kind of helping him. Get through. Elbow, elbow. Get through. Elbow, elbow, elbow. It's just... Oh, gee. It's so obvious everything they're doing. Yeah. Fuck me. Yeah, they always were opting to use his own ultimate in the way. Has to dodge round the corner. There was a nade sent flying, and it's got Giants into the site. Now the Rolling Thunder, and a bit of spam. It has caught him up close and personal. It matters not. Fatinio's behind him, though, dodging the dog, almost going down to it. Trying to come see. Oh, that bomb down, bomb okay, down. Okay, 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 good job. Down, I have I nice! Have so, so, so. Big fucking round! Come on! I'm walking with Yasu. Hit him on you, hit on him. Hit on you. On site, on site. He knows the crash is at least there. Now the paranoia, so he knows both players are in that nice, position, nice. but crash has already worked. Shit, it's a fast rotation using his own ult. So they're gonna have the bodies, they're gonna have the players to try and fight this one. Dart's not being watched for, but the weapons. A little bit weak! <laughs> the two opening, 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 opening in. Doggy, wait, I'm doggy. Same spot, same spot, nice, elbow, nice, elbow. Nice, he's up, he's up. Nice. Nice. nice, Austin. Nice, Austin. Nice. Let's go, guys. Let's go. Come on. Go. We got the four. four. Is, yeah, four is this good. This is bro. fucking good. Four is good. Switching. It's fine. Our T side is so good, bro. Oh, yeah. These kids won't even know what's hitting them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what door? Door, door, door. Door fight. Door fight. Get, get, get. Get back to the door. Bow, 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 bow. Bow, bow, bow. Bow, bow. Water. Lane, water, water! Players nice! Players. John, you're on fire, man! Let's just three, two, one, go. Yeah. Nice. nice, John. Let's Come go. on, big pistol! Yeah, Artem, Artem. 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 Position and the wall still pushing back, Giants! Movement and still two players remain. A rifle in his hands, but some does a lot to contain. Yeah. Yes! Go, baby! Yes! Oh, big no. And this could get more than scrappy, this could get absolutely dangerous. Spamming into it one after the other. Evanesto claiming. 12 seconds remaining. The utility alone should deny this. And there we go. Moving forwards, one blast back. Oh, he's missed it! He's missed it! Moves away, a tap and a spy. Evanes knows they're not there. The decay is fading. They need to take this no! Well, nice! But Evanes no! comes up one Come on! Oh, now it's goes one. That's gonna be dealt with. Position's known as bound first. One water, one down. He's out, out, dude. No! no! Let's close this shit out! Come on! Come on, man! White room, the utility. Crashy does have the dart. No one was watching this angle, FNS. Bit of a risk. Drops down! No one clears the corner. And it's all up to Som. He's a dream to this right, but he knows when he's there. And that's a jump peek. So aware by Hoodie. So aware. Picks up the rifle, baits the re swing, and Giants. Once more are one round away from taking this map. Paranoia still in line for Ryman. There we go. As soon as they hear that. 
Util being used, it's ever so slightly missed time though, and Rhymestone wants to take the fight, and Evanes, I mean, forced to white at all really for them, Rhymestone in the back of the side, just trying to take the fight, no so fight. just walking his way in, but just the duels being taken, the Tinio no Duke is backing him up, and now it's down to Ardis, the 1v3, one, three, one round away, he's found the first one, but there's still so much to do, trading the angle once, nice try, uh, and NRG really pushed them, but Giants say, we got to win in OT? All right, fine. Have it your way. I don't want to talk about the match. Let's talk about next. I mean, regardless, like, when we get, like, posts and shit, we have to, like... They have to just be better play. in the post. The posts have to be better. Um, besides that, there's nothing else. Yeah. Because if Killjoys, Killjoy and Jet just the opposite. So wherever Killjoy is, Jet is the opposite. To be honest, we were expected to beat them. I wouldn't say beatable, but like they were one-dimensional. Like we kind of knew what they were going to do. I think we were feeling like a little bit down, but um, I think we had a lot of confidence going into Haven and Icebox just because we had a good game plan and like uh, videos to review. Time play off of each other. It's a dangerous position to play in Hell. Currently, where Ardis is, there's a lot that could go wrong for him there. But it's a dash through, and that's the shock dart from Crash. He's already claiming the first one. Close into the smoke. Tahat not being dealt with, a bit of spam, not quite enough for it, but biding their time still. Yeah, doing it now. I'm sliding, I'm sliding, I'm sliding, hide, hide, hide. One short. Short one. Hold, hold, hold. Player standing. One enemy remaining. That's the heavy Nice! Yeah. Good shit, they're good fucking oh. pistol. Swinging all the way through, and they're just opting to try and play with the rifles, play with the spam, and here we go. Hoodie could have been a difference maker there, but it's just down. Anuki one shot found, and a weak enough player than Ardis. Nice, Ardis! You're fucking back, baby, come on! In the short, in the short, in the short, one back side. What, what, what? One more, one more, one more, over there. Nice, two beats, pop ones, pop ones. I would he suck if he sucks in the game? Let's go! Austin, come on! Good <gasps> shit! Stop, stop, stop. <laughs> Giants left to scramble. Big investment, obviously, with the guns, but the swing players remaining. The flank by Victor as well, just containing. No one was watching. Surrounded. Leave to your right. On every okay. front, and slow squeeze. And this crash is nice. also taking space just like that. Team, what? What the fuck a whimper out, to end the round, but a ring. Strong, sharp, wooden shit. Everybody was on point uh, for the side of energy, and it's, I mean, you gotta give a lot of credit, of course, over to Finesse, but pretty much everybody across the board had such a leveled up performance. Yeah, but I'm expecting them to bounce back here on Icebox, just like the way uh, NRG. But, how do they want to take this one? A lot of the players gearing up for potential push forwards, and it looks like they are trying to take matters into their own hands, right past the wall. But to you, <laughs> you can't be pulling that out, Victor, not again! Nice. Yes, yes, sir, yes, yeah. fucking sir, baby. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, most of the situation, but not enough for them. Lovely spray down by Som. The aim reset. There, this guy. Yes, yes. yes. I will fucking own these oh, guys. Oh, come on. Let's go, baby. Half fly round for the beat up for them. Artist, this angle. Oh, my goodness. Damage to keep him. Get it back. Yeah. 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 Set up on top of 410. Hoodie's going to be dropping back, but last player left standing. Nice, Austin. Come on! You wanna so you you get it? I, saw it. I mean, during the Giants game on stage, I was like, I nearly passed out. I don't know what the fuck was going on. Like, I was going dizzy. Like, I was, I was, I definitely had something. I don't know what I had. I was the flu or something. Pause, 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 please, pause. Pause, 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 yeah, um, my head just started spinning up. Yeah, yeah, but like, uh, um, let's go. Let's go, go, go. Let's go. Good. It's a massive shot, needs a massive play to happen. Still the players are there, one shot found for the trade. Necessary now with the spray down. So I'm still cleaning them up and doing the most. Yes, 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 the rest to bring Hoodie back up. Crashies has all. Is ticking. Crashies has his all. Under Fury and nobody cares. Som holding it down. Three kills. And what more can you do? Clouds. Yes! Come on! Come on, Austin. Yes! Yes! Looking good, but 
it was just such a, a massive lead that NRG had built in that first Yeah, there's just something special about NRG and these these comebacks, these these later maps in series. They looked incredible. On to the next. Yeah. On the win, baby. That's what we do. On to the next, baby. Nah, you want to know the cheat code, guys? I didn't chew my gum first map, that's why we lost. Playing the gum, second map, 13-1, you know how B-Low light work. And then third map, yeah, we just start, started off strong. Lost pistol, actually, and uh, everything after that was pretty clean. Uh, we had the good game plan on them. Chet and John just made our lives super easy, so props to them. We literally just play. Props to them, make our lives super easy. We literally just play. <laughs> Um, so yeah, uh, we beat Giants 2-1. It was honestly a pretty tough match, um, but we honestly felt like we had it in the bag even after we lost first map. After we beat Giants, we were all pretty hype about it and kind of happy with our performance. Back to back MVP? Back to back, MVP. Back to back? I didn't really see it as like getting MVP. Um, I kind of just kind of saw it as like we won. Um, I kind of didn't really care about my individual, obviously I did to some extent, but I think I cared more about winning and losing. And so winning the first two matches obviously felt great. Um, and yeah, I guess for my individual performance, I was pretty happy with this. <laughs> Need security. Never know what'll happen. Hopefully I'm safe. When we were winning those crazy rounds, I was like, oh my God, bro, what well, is happening? I thought Bro, you know the, the last round when I killed the one I really smoke? I was like, I need to pre fight, pre fight. And I was like, fuck, I'm not gonna pre fight it. And I peek and I see the breach and I was like, you fucking clown. Oh my god, I was so sad on that one round, 1v1, Ryan walked into the omen smoke. I, you. That's another pro. How I didn't get that kill, bro. I was I was, I was about to oh, smack yeah, Dude, yeah. I'm like, dude, if he gets this kill, we win bro, this game. Yeah, yeah. Bro, after that, I was like, bro, this is luck. I actually said to my head, I was like, we've lost the game. That was, <laughs> that was actually, that was like, the thing is, I had the perfect advantage. Play. I, had the I know, advantage I know, I know. Well. You made the perfect play. Yeah, it's not a miracle, bro. That's a miracle. I was cooking, though. So obviously we just beat Giants. It feels really, really good because obviously we were down a map to zero. So um, to be able to beat them in the fashion that we did, beating them on Haven as badly and then as on Icebox as well, as badly as we did, feels good. Obviously we have a lot more to prepare for. We got two days left before uh, the game versus Loud. Overall, it feels pretty satisfying to be able to beat a team like that, especially when you're one map down. Lotus was also our pick, so losing that map was pretty tough for us, but we were able to come back. As far as the Loud game goes, we're not really too sure what to expect. Uh, I don't think they've played, they've shown too much yet at the tournament. Uh, there's going to be a, definitely a crowd buff for them. But as far as the gameplay goes, not sure really what to expect from them. So we just finished playing. Uh, we just won our match versus Giants, 2-1. to uh, Shouldn't have lost a map, but we did. It's all good. And now we're celebrating with Green Barbecue. Man, some of the guys got sick today. It's been kind of a crazy day. We're trying to find the best solution right now um, and just hoping for the best, you know? We don't want these guys ending up having to go to the hospital or anything. So yeah, after the match, uh, I was getting pretty sick and yelling on top of that during the Giants game didn't help at all. So when I woke up Saturday morning, um, lost my voice completely. Jeff, 
I think you try. It's probably gonna taste like mouthwash, that ass. I'll try it, I'll try it first. <laughs> um, but me and Sam, like specifically, just were not feeling good that day. Uh, we canceled, we played like three scrims and we canceled the rest of practice and me and Sam actually w ended up going to a hospital. Yeah, we were, it was like pretty unique experience to be honest. Yeah, I, I told her about- Not fever, but like everyone Yeah, yeah, symptoms. I told her about Psalm, I said Austin's sick and I said Artis is sick. I have a headache, sore throat, coughing, stuffy nose, runny nose. I have fucking all flu symptoms. <laughs> oh, where is this? Uh, they smoke this, right? Oh. So I have another one too. Oh, I'm I'm one here and... So when I heard that Austin and Sam were sick, instantly I was like, I can't be playing with people that are sick. It's just, we've already had it happen to us once uh, in Berlin. I didn't really want that happening again. We lost matches because of it in the past. So for me, I was instantly like, all right, we got to go tell Riot, like, what's going on. Um, at the very least, see if we could push the match back because we needed our players to recover. Sam literally didn't have a voice. Why can't they? Because of the schedule. Right. Change it. Treat it I, like I, I agree with you that there's a schedule. It's a set schedule they have to go through, right? But the players cannot play. Let's just say they cannot play physically because they're not feeling well. Yeah. What can, what can be done then? Do we have to forfeit our game? Do we have to use our sixth man? What if it's two players? Austin was essentially just had all the symptoms of a flu. Um, Luckily for us, that things panned out in a way where they got better the next day, but Sam legit had no voice and <clears throat> Austin had a flu, so. That, that practice was absolutely one of the worst practices because like I was just calming for Sam, so I couldn't even focus on the rest of the team. So I just had to like speak the whole time just for one guy and then if something went wrong in the round, I couldn't like figure it out. So it was just like one of the least productive days I think we had. In my opinion, you get, we should play this one, and then you two should go to the hospital. Honestly. As annoying as it's going to be. I know, it's pretty fucked. I agree. Well, you know, when my teammates are sick, I'm going to do everything in my power to make it so that they have time to get better. Especially because, you know, in this circuit, in any circuit in Valorant, you don't have too many tournaments that you can play in. So, for us, you know, you go four events, maybe five events a year. You want to make the best of, out of it. It's our job to perform at our best, but we're not going to be able to if people are sick. So pushing the match back would have been ideal, but at the end of the day, it is what it is. Nothing can you know, like change about it. Um, the decision was made to continue going forward, but for me, it was very concerning because if your players are not at 100%, it's going to be difficult to play knowing that. And um, you know, it's going to be difficult for them to play with that responsibility on their shoulders as well. Welcome back one and all to lock in here and look, Yankees and Red Sox, Lakers and the Celtics, Shawn Michaels and Bret Hart, The Rock and Stone Cold Steve Austin, I Kenny Omega and Hangman Adam Page. Sorry, I'm going too off of the goop here. Of course, all classic rivalries. And of course, we have our own cooking here, in, right here in Valorant, NRG and Loud. And this is going to be awesome. These teams have squared off against each other <laughs> multiple times. <laughs> this Optic and Loud, uh, rivalry, this NRG Loud rivalry, it spanned all of the pre-partnerships era, they're dead even, and it was the defining rivalry that actually culminated at the end of Champions. That's nasty. Uh, the Optic Core, now NRG, the best team of the pre-partnership era, most consistent. You have Loud, who won the most recent tournament, are your reigning champions heading into this one. And I think this matchup is even more exciting because it's single elimination. Only one of them can make it to the top. No, when I woke up, I could talk, so I was pretty, pretty happy about that. Literally the day before, I couldn't talk at all. Um, it was that bad. So finally waking up to a voice felt nice. So. I feel the same as yesterday, but you know, we move, we keep on going, and yeah, that's the way of life. Yeah, I mean, like I said, like we don't really focus on you know preparing mentally for that stuff. Like as a team, it just kind of comes naturally. Um, obviously, you know, the core of us, me, Victor, and FNS against their core. Uh, we have so much, you know, so much rivalry between each other. So, we, like I said, we know it was gonna be a crazy game, and. Yeah, we just we just were ready for that day. Uh, yeah, knowing going into a game, knowing people are sick. Uh, I mean, I don't think it really changes anything. Uh, we're all professionals. We know that. Yeah, things happen. Sometimes you're gonna be sick for an official, and there's nothing that the tournament organizer can do. So yeah, we're all professionals. We just knew. We just gotta give everything we got in that moment. Good. 
usually feeling anxious before games, so it's normal for me. So Austin's feeling slightly better. Uh, Sam has his voice back, which is really important for us. That was the main concern that we had, is we wouldn't have a guy that was calming, but he seems to have his voice back, so that's important for us. And yeah, we're just going to do the best that we can. After beating Koi and Giants, um, I want to say we had a lot of momentum and honestly we were all like pretty hyped about it. Um, we, honestly, I felt like we had this run and everything was going to plan. Um, we felt like every game we were taking it one step at a time and I felt like our chemistry was probably at its peak around then. Eh, I mean, I've had, the, I've had the crowd against me before. Maybe not as much as it was there. Like I remember when we got, we got out to our little like area where we could do our hair and makeup, and I, I'm hearing like "Vua mo hair, Vua mo hair." I was, I was sort of along the line. <laughs> These guys love us, bro. These guys love us, bro. They chatted like, "Let's go for an NRG or something." And then I, I saw it on like I saw it on Twitter. It says like, "I kill you or something. We kill you or I want you to die or something like that." I was like, "Ooh, these guys are chatting something different." You know, you know what I mean? So. Uh, I, I, don't, I remember being the first guy to walk in too. So uh, I mean, it's cool. It was cool in the way that like uh, that there's fans like showing their support for their team. Uh, that's cool, uh, but it wasn't cool that we just had to walk in like that. Us uh, cheering against us and like booing us. Yeah, this one, oh, I, just walk, I just walked by it and they were doing all that shit. JD, yeah, yeah. on Twitter, eh? We're gonna put it on Twitter, I think. Uh, I wanna tweet with that. I think they're saying we love you guys. Like that, that's gonna bang, bro. <laughs> we didn't know we were our own favorite. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you haven't seen anything yet. Watch when we get on stage. I'm sure people are, are sick of me mentioning this, but the, the format does not allow you to have slow starts. And so no. far, Energy, that has been <laughs> consistent with them across their games. They can't allow that to happen, especially with this crowd behind. Right. We're saying that they sometimes drop map one, they sometimes lose in group stage, and they sometimes start out rough in the first half. Those are three different issues, really. Sure. And I don't think, I mean, there's no group stage here. They haven't lost a series so far. And the deeper they get into the tournament, I think they'll start shoring it up. So I'm not really that worried anymore. Yeah, that's right. And look, folks, you honestly couldn't have asked for a better way to close out the entirety of the Alpha Bracket. It's a champion's rematch. We also have ourselves a Cinderella story run. Who knows what can happen with that? Yeah, so we actually while we were waiting to go out on stage, um, they show our pictures on like the big screen before we go out. So when they showed our pictures, like the crowd did a like big boo. And we all And then when they showed the loud pictures, like the whole like venue erupted. Like we had to be the villains that day. And of course we have two matches that are going to set the stage for the entirety of the season ahead. It is genuinely incredible where we are right now in Valorant Esports history and it's only going to get better. So folks, I hope you're ready because the lock-in day six starts right now. NRG have prepped here. We talk about NRG being such a heavy oriented prep team. Actually, early on here, we thought that oh, thought quick. for a moment. Ardis spotted four, and now oh. no secrets on the Cloud way. Cloud have a decent amount of space, though, taking over towards heaven. It will be challenged here, and he has lost down. Zalek doing well in the crowd, certainly happy about it. Actually, like Som here. It's got to be less to find it, though, because Som slip away. He's oh. found it. Zalek now. Zalek has to hold the fort here. Oh, and the, the timing on the replay is absolutely insane. 
Trying to hold on there. Nice smoke. Quite a little cover, but the aggression. Nice smoke. This is really nice. They're putting the pressure on. They're trying to make this work. And the next is down. First strike allowed here. That did actually got filtered. Got it back in, but no, not at all. Not too clean here. Already losing on two, but any more would be quite surprising. Crashies. I'm about to turn my sound up. All dog to bring into effect. First contact made. Picked up. Uh, one more, one more, one more, one more. One more, one more, one more. That knife. So Aspat's going to be filtering back through, looking to try and support, oh, and it's a oh, shot oh, and a half. Huge impact here. And Crash is now a 1v2. Nice try, nice try. Stop. Worried here. Actually falls away and finds a touch of safety, but... Yeah, he's, he's, he's cooked. Shot! What? what? Less! Sorry. Victor for... No, no, get the screen. That's it! Right. Straight, baby. Nice! Yes! I don't oh, think he's got it. I don't think yeah, he's, he's got, got it. Got it. It's gonna be so close. so close. So close here. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Come on. Where's that next pressure point built from here? As bad. Oh my god, he's got one. Takes out FNS. The underhand flash should have blinded, but still gonna find the frag. It's just crashing the line. The crowd's getting louder. How does he do anything in this? They went up the last couple years from heaven. How meticulously do they clear it all at once? He drops down to his. All too aware. 26 HP. And we hit the four. Brazilian block! Let's fucking get it. Let's get it. That's right. We'll call this round done! Because Tui's has got three! Top of the hat trick! Doesn't get the fourth! The crashies! Have you got it in you? You got one minute to play with him. Oh, nice try. Oh. Oh. They <laughs> <laughs> literally just, this is 2 I told you, it shoots back. I mean, it just starts so slow, bro. Yeah, whatever the fuck it is. Like that first was wrong, we should have won too. Uh, I don't remember what happened. Uh, no, we got like an entry. They did an A split, but they did some MVP after. It doesn't oh, matter. Yeah. It doesn't matter. Well, after split, and like we got dismantled by them, we knew like. For at least Pearl, they didn't know what to expect from us, and we knew a lot of information on them already. So again, like we had more like videos to review, so it worked in our favor. Yeah, uh, it was pretty demotivating losing split to be honest, because our split has been, had been going well during practice, and we were watching back their split, and we felt like we could counter their game plan and their their comp. So it was pretty demoralizing to lose in that fashion on that map. We all have been down a map already in our lives in the series, so it's not anything new to us. I, think, I actually don't think NRG crumbled under the pressure of the crowd or the pressure of the moment. I think they crumbled under the pressure of the aggression. Yeah. It was an actual in-server, in-game pressure. It's very different. These guys know what it's like to play on the big stage. They're not getting nervous. They're getting overrun. Stop. 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 We're not going to win playing perfect. But he, you see nothing. Yeah. Come back, come back, come back. Find the right side of the right side. Find the right side. Shown here, Dewey makes a light work of FMS. Pause at the swings, crashes. Try to do what he can, but let. It's only nice four right nice now. Okay. Okay. As Aspas finally makes his debut on the site. He's play. Oh my God, he's gone away with daylight robbery. It's only one. That could have been so much worse. And Dewey's now outdone, outgunned. Don't you? Come on. Come on. Don't give him kills, he's on a heater. Camera running away. Camera. Good round. Good invest there. Yeah, he will. It's going to shut off a lot of sight, force them into spawn. So he's going to be putting the pressure here. Yeah, dealt with Artis with a double as well. Beautiful time for him to strike. Couldn't quite get away from it though. Aspas. Outstanding. Come to the end, end, end. Low, 105 hyper. Up, up. Two. Challenge on this angle, the plant's gonna come in. But they have really very few safe post plant positions. Two is winning out. That's massive. All comes in. NLG want to address this quickly, and they do. Crashes takes him down. The overwhelm is there. NLG holding onto the side four now. Finally, a player up to the good. Sanak still standing, but only for so long. And now. Nice! Oh. 
That's right, nice. Artis. 21 yeah. did swing comes in. Artis fit to go down. And suddenly there's a gateway open. Crashes and FNS are sweating. They're what? worried. But FNS. Oh, FNS! What time to come alive! Three big kills and the young got two What one. can you do with it? That's one. Needs a second. One more second to play with. Gonna get him. Oh, he's got to be locked down. Oh, and crashes his arm the way. Knife in hand. He's going to dice him up. Oh, no! In front of the whole crowd. <laughs> come on. Give me some. The booze right out. Some not reacting just yet. The flash is perfect for counting. Going to see something from him. That's two this round. Can't make much more of it. A 3v2 now. Victor and Som. What are you going to do with it? Les is standing and delivering. And the diffusion ain't stopping Victor. Oh my word. He denies it. Goes back in. Nice try, bro. Fuck. Overwhelmed. Outgunned. How much? Oh my god. Oh my god. He's gone away with it. That's so much damage already done and big information as well. Look at them. Less down to 22. Aspect. Come on, main, one more main. Main, main, last. Right. Nice. Oh, oh, come on, get on trade artists. Someone get on it fast. Down getting on it, getting on it. does get lucky. Too smart, too smart, too smart. The timing on that snap. I have good plan. Good stick. Yeah, yeah. Have, have. Wait, up. someone, someone, anyone, nice. someone, yes, stop sir. it, I don't Rashi. Think so. Right have under their nose. I'm bolting, I'm bolting. Just pass each other like ships in the night, and the KJ ult oh, comes in as well. Back to the ult. Spike the spam comes out, it's crash, he's fighting Zalek. This could be 12. No, that's got it in our G. Yes, that's Finally, opens on the spike. Yeah. And now, Epinus finds Aspas. Do he? He's still firing off. Oh my god. So tries to hold it. And he. Oh, Absolutely don't. It's one. He's seen a second. He knows he's got a second here. But those seconds are dwindling and he's got to make... Oh, what? on it! Less than Sadak. 12 seconds. Time. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, no, no, no. Use your half. Use your half. Go out. Go out. Go out. Half. I don't know where. He jumped away. He jumped away. Nice! Nice, nice artist. Good shit, artist. Good shit. Come on. Alive in OT. Two kills already. FNS takes the next point of attention. Yeah, yes! Let's go. Lock the fuck yes. in. Yes! Let's in. fucking go, John. Good support back nice. call. Oh in, Mike. Aspas. This has to be everything in FNS! Set less than two E's. Oh, it's perfect! And we have to go the distance. Surely, two E's trying everything he can. He's got Let's yes. go. Let's go. Let's yes! Go. Let's yes! Go. Relax, relax. I want to win this game. Come on! Where the fuck's the crowd? Where the fuck's the crowd? Honestly, it shouldn't have gone to overtime. I think we were up like 12-8 at one point. So we felt like we should have closed out Pearl way earlier. Um, after winning it and then going into map three, um, we definitely felt like we had it. Yeah, so going into map three, we, we want to just sharpen up. Finally, everything's ready. Let's just close this out. And then, I mean, to take the overtime win, obviously it felt really good for us. And now we, you know, it's, it's even series 1-1. We're all in the game now, everyone. Everyone is just in match mode, so I, I would say spirits were high after that. Mimi, what Woo! a game. I mean, the crowd, just the calls, the shots, artists just throwing bullets into smokes and getting kills for no reason. The man's absurd. It was unreal. I think it was getting overrun. Instantly, Kalzin and Aspas break down some and artists and draw first blood. That's oh. a pinch is perfect as well. The fault line. So precise, a double flank coming through from Bridge, but Tui's on hand for the first oh, and the on. second. Tui's will find another isolated here. Crashes Not will bad. close it out. It is a 2v2 now. The Nano Swarm will find one, and that's a little fumble there, but Cowan Zeen will find one. Yes, they do. But how do they clear that all? Do they even have the time for this? Can they just start that they defuse? Could, they could stick it. They and could absolutely Artis stick this. And now needs to defend this. Les needs to get involved. He has to try and do something. The stick on the defuse. Yes. Yes. They used all the fucking ults and they lost. Good fucking just shit. Now fighting for territory and winning it. And now FNS and Artis, what do you do? Up and above, Artis. Decapitates Kalzin. Takes down Sadak. And now left side, left side, left side. No, no. Artis. Artis. Artis, come Let's on. Let's go, baby. Yeah, Come on! Good. Time is against them here. Working it down perfectly. FNS is just going to try and sit this one as best he can, and it's actually off. Hold on! There was a chance, and it slipped away. Loud! They're going tower to help. Tower. 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 T
We had an advantage going into Fracture, but again, we got off to a little bit of a slow start. Um, we kind of got in our own heads a little bit and messed up our pistol round. It kind of sucked to go down so much so early again, and kind of having flashbacks of how Split was going to go. Or well how. enough to get the trade at least. County now locked in between. Big old oh, oh, place. No! Oh, the kill! Oh, already tenderized earlier on, down so low. Good trade for some. Off you, brother. Yes. Go, man. Let's yes. go. Yes, I'll yes. Dig it deeper than before. This could be 12 on the board. Crash, he's low. Finds two back in. And now Aspas and Zelak still standing, but not for long. Oh, wait, wait, Crash, wait, wait, he's good right now. Yes, Austin, Austin come good. on. Good right now. Let's go. Austin. The 12 11 round, um, yeah. So 12 11, uh, we had the post plant. We had all of the map control and the post plant. It's time. Oh, John Ult, a safe ult. We, we know one's me, the one's on. Yes, yes. Josh is playing. Josh is playing. Ready? 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 We double swung the guy Sands, and we killed him. Or Pujan killed him from spawn, and then it was a 3v1. We had all of spawn. Then as soon as we go to peak, he aftershocks. Like he, uh, the, the breach aftershocks, I mean, Sam's angle for peak. Ready? 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 And then now it's up just a 1v1 with John, and... One go one, one go one, two balls. Stop fighting for you. Two balls. Oh my god! Oh my god! Goatine! Keeping hope alive below! What a round! And it was pretty devastating. Um, when he didn't hit the shot when he was crossing, but he hit a nice shot on Blue John. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Hey, they're the one that choked the fucking lead. It's okay. A centimeter apart, really. It's like not the focus they need a pick. Just too many bodies and they're falling. Yeah. Yes, John! Yes, John! Good round! Spot points, spot points. The sun's up here, but they still can't break through those back three less. Think about it. Fall. And now the time is for strike! He's taken down FNF! And now he takes the ball down! We go again! That's a problem. Cowan's in! But it's alive! Some! Got a pin towards default, Aspas tries to turn the back. Yes! 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 We will never fucking yeah. lose those, ever! Come on! Hold him, hold him. Outdoor, outdoor! Low, low! Hit for 80. Help, they need help, artist. They need help. Out, out. Hey, mate, they need help. Hit for 80. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. Outside. What Outside. on Outside. earth is going on? Outside. 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 What? <laughs> what are these rounds? He's into the back. Do they still check? Yes, they do. Sadek, brilliant heads up play. Stop. He's there to help him out, but actually, crashes has fallen. Victor. NLG tucking in now. Shot to the half. FNS big. Off John, we are hands. Tui's at 24 HP. Probably the death of him now. First player seen. Nice, nice, John. Go. Nice, John. Come on. It's a huge round. Crash is the only one alive. Barely. Walking wounded. Now to be the walking dead. Let's go. The timing. Crashes fight Maybe it's all but done. Crashes and FNS. The last two alive. They've got their work cut out to save at least FNS. The timing ain't there. And it's all there.
sorry, but we had a yeah, fucking was, game was, one. It was, it was not a one person. The, the round where I fucking killed the guy's CT. Yeah, I don't, I don't what know. What is how going we, on? How Everyone is peeking for absolutely. I have no idea how we lose that round. That's the only <laughs> round where I was about. Are you kidding me? Yeah, I saw that. Dude, we fucking had that, bro. We fucking had that, bro. Stop right now! Fuck, bro. There's no talking. There is actually, it's only no, there was, cons. There was so only, when there's only cons, when there's a 2v2, that we're confident winning. It feels like we're not even playing. In our head stories, no, but, but also, but also, whoever planted the bomb inside the box, right? Whoever planted there, sh should be saying, "Can we play on box, not for us?" Oh, should, just one of the two. Like that, just like that, because you said after whoever it was after said we should be playing think, on. Think, let's not play off. I think right? we're too comfortable playing off on a comp where you don't have kills. No, but also the plan. That's also fun. Doesn't even matter. The plan no, it doesn't matter. No, the plan was off. I'm pretty sure I planned that wrong because they were using everything towards me. They mollied me. No, they no, that's fine. me. That's fine. I'm saying, but, but, but let's play with me too when you were CT. There was comms, they set the double peak, and I don't know what happened after that. Because I was watching you the whole time. Okay, so if there's comms, there's nothing, you just killed the rules. I was, I was dead. I don't know what happened. Uh, if you guys are ready, we need you guys out right now. We're just going to clean your room just, and give it to the next team. Don't worry. Actually, don't worry. Thanks very much, everybody. Bye. It's okay. That was a really frustrating loss. I think the worst loss that we've experienced as a team, or at least as a core, uh, for sure um, a lot to look back at and kind of see like, hey, what went wrong. But for this specific loss, when I got back to my room, I kind of just told myself, I'm not gonna react how I normally react because this is just the beginning. Um, not to make excuses, but it is just the beginning. We have a whole year ahead of us. There's no point in us freaking out about one loss, even if it was a pretty bad loss. Um, all we can do is learn from it, and all we can do is get better anyway, so I've said this before, I'm going to say it again, no one's going to remember this event going into the end of the year. Um, maybe a few people here and there, but like, end of the day, this event is not a Masters event, it's not a Champions, so it's okay to make mistakes now, so long as, you know, you're able to fix them and improve it throughout the year. So that's kind of the mindset that I had and the emotions that I had personally, but obviously every player is different. I mean, this is definitely not a finish that we're used to having. Like, we're used to always having like top three, like at least <clears throat> me, Austin, FNS, and Victor. So like, and I guess artists to some extent. So we're not used to like finishing this early. Would have loved another chance at the tournament, but just doesn't allow for it. So just, we just kind of had to accept it and kind of sucks. Tomorrow or like the day after? It could, it could be as early as tomorrow. Tonight or not? Not tonight.